Hey what's up guys welcome back to our channel technology so today in this video I'm going to show you guys how to fix a startup problem in your Windows 10 PC or laptop so you just need to follow me and don't forget to subscribe my channel technology so the first method is you have to disable first boot on your Windows 10 PC or laptop so for that you need to go to your start menu and click on this setting button over there now you will get this window so you have to click on system and on the left side corner you will get one option over there is called power and sleep so click over there and scroll down any under related setting you will get one option is called additional power setting so click over there and on the left side corner you will get one option is called choose uh, what the power buttons do so click over there now you have to uh, click on this button is called change settings uh, that are un uh, currently unavailable okay so click over there and you have to uncheck this option which is turn on first uh, startup okay after that click on save changes so the next option is you have to disable apex svc in your windows 10 computer so for that you need to go to your start menu first after that type over there reg edit and you have to click on this registry editor app and click on yes now you'll get this window so what you have to do you need to expand this h key local machine on your computer and after that uh, you have to expand system and you have to expand now uh, control set 001 and now you have to expand services and under services you will get one uh, folder like app x svc so here is a, a folder as you can see so you have to click over there and on the right side corner you will get a uh, start so you have to set this uh, d word value uh, 3 to 4 means you have to set here 4 so just double click over there and you have to uh, type over there 4 now click on ok and after that restart your computer so still if it is not working on your computer then just unplug your all the usb devices on your computer and after that plug it again and reboot your computer after that it will fix your problem so i hope this small video will really help for you and please don't forget to click on the subscribe button like button and share button and if you have any questions or questions then comments down below i will see you guys in the next one next video take care